We sat Never. down about talked we about. We sat soccer. down with goalie Eric Klonofsky. And um, I don't know about you, but Eric is definitely a big asset to Monmouth University. I personally think he's going to go pro. I'm also not saying this because I'm biased and he's one of my great friends. But he's just an overall great person. And there's really nothing bad to say about him. I mean, like, if you look at his career, then you know how well he is for Monmouth University. That's awesome. I'm very lo much looking forward to this interview we had with him the other week then. So let's check that out. The season's been um, filled with adversity. But um, with any good team, with any championship team, you're going to have to face adversity at some point, you know. Injuries like mine, strips concussion, Dave's red card, you know, it's, it's stuff that we can't necessarily control. But I think there's uh, great pieces within the program, and, and I fully expect us to go on a run. When we're down, guys. The depth of our roster is tested in, this, in these moments, you know what I mean, when I'm injured, when, when Strip gets injured or Dave has to come off or any other important pieces because the rest of the team certainly very, very talented as well. But, yeah, that's when our freshman class really has to show what they got. And, Mike Luke stepping up, Jeff Schaefer, Ryan Wells. You know, we got a ton of guys that are, that are really stepping up, which is good. It was really hard for me to not be on the field. You know, I've played, I think, like 65 straight games for Monmouth or something. So it was frustrating. But, you know, if you're going to be great, you got to go through something. So um, it's something that I understand I had to deal with. You know what I mean? But um, everything happens for a reason, you know. I was very excited to get back. Um, at the same time that I was excited to get back, I was also a bit timid to, to re-injure it, you know what I mean? Because the doctor's like, yeah, you got the cast on, but you're good. You're good to go. I mean, <laughs> like, it was just a weird kind of situation that I'd never really been in before. So it's great to be back, but I was definitely a bit timid when I first got back. Set piece by Ryder. There's one to his back. Another, he got the right hand up. And then this last one, just getting enough before coming in to get a piece. I just want to go out and, and know that whatever I did, I put the best Eric Klonofsky out there that I could. Um, Homecoming's always kind of a, a weird time for us, you know what I mean? We usually have, it's usually all throughout the day because football games are during the day and, and we have games at 7 o'clock, so as much as we'd want to be out there and support it, we've we got to focus on we, what we got going on, you know what I mean? So you'll probably see us out there, but we're focused on the game, you know what I mean? So make an appearance move from there, focus on the game. As a team, I just want to win. I want to win every game I can. I want to throw clean sheets as much as possible, and that's, um, that's all I want to do. You know what I mean? I, just because it's the last game doesn't really mean it changes anything from the game point of view. So get a win, get a shutout, enjoy it. So since that sit down with Eric, the, the soccer team has been struggling a bit, but they are fighting hard, trying to make the postseason. Uh, and Eric, Believe it or not, has been playing goalie with a broken hand. I know. That's insane. <laughs> Kudos to him. That's that's incredible. He's His senior great. year trying to make the best of it. I don't blame him. Absolutely. And the team never gives up. With one more game left tonight on the Great Lawn, they make they look to make the MAC tournament. So I hope to see all of you there.